You've got it tuned to listener-powered radio. We're 90.3 FM KEXP in Seattle. You can find us online around the world at KEXP.org. Today we're super excited to have Viet Cong live on air with us. Welcome. Hey, thank you. We are Hi. so happy you made it. Yeah, we made it just by the skin of our teeth. <laughs> I don't know where that expression comes from. but <laughs> <laughs> Actually, now you got me from. thinking about that. Yeah. Some listeners going to look it up and let us know before this is over. It's probably extremely offensive to someone out there. <laughs> How about some of the music? Got a couple right. songs for us? Yeah, we got a couple of songs. Awesome. Viet Cong ripping it up live here in the KEXP studios. Tonight they're heading down to Portland. They'll be at Mississippi Studios. Super glad you're here today. Thank you.
Via Kong live here in the KEXP studios tonight. They're playing at Mississippi Studios in Portland. Then you're yeah. hopscotching around, coming back to Seattle on March 27th. Yeah, we've got a lot of driving ahead of us. I hope we're, you. We're basically professional truck drivers, and we play music on the side. <laughs> you guys do a lot of touring. You hopefully you enjoy being out on the road. I know it can take its toll. Yeah, it gets hectic from time to time, but uh, we we take things in stride. When I follow the genealogy of the band, I feel like I really do need to draw out a family tree. Suffice it to say, you guys have played together in different projects and been hanging out musically for a while. Yeah, absolutely. Um, me and Mike have been friends since childhood. We grew up in the same neighborhood. And playing street hockey and drinking chocolate milk. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> playing street hockey and drinking chocolate milk. I don't know if you, so you heard that. but I love that image. We were somewhat wholesome. <laughs> what are you saying? We're not wholesome now? <laughs> Maybe you're still drinking chocolate milk. <laughs> a little Bailey's in it, though. <laughs> and um, is it true that you have a black sa or have played in a black Sabbath band together? Yeah, we. we found yeah, we found we found our guitar player Danny through the love of Black Sabbath. Um, and this band is fun, but that was the most fun I've ever had <laughs> playing music in my entire life. You got to keep it fun. You know, you can always do that in your spare time, you know, exactly. since you got the, got the players here. <laughs> is it true that the sort of the seed germinated for this project when you and Monty were touring with Chad Van Galen or playing in his band? Yeah, exactly. Um, yeah. We were playing with Chad every single night for a while. And usually at the end of the night, we kind of had a few drinks on us and started talking about um, the possibility of doing something together when we got back into Calgary. And then we just did it. I know that you, uh, as we've been talking about, you've been in a bunch of bands. Is this the first time that you kind of took the songwriting, you know? Yeah, I guess so. Um, when it first started off, I guess I was doing a good chunk of, of the songwriting and Monty was doing the other good chunk of it. And um, in the time since, we've kind of become more of a collaboration with the four of us. So. 
I heard you mentioned that you're from Calgary, which I have a love affair with Canada and so many great bands coming out of there. There must be something in the frozen water, but it's pre I've never made it up to Calgary. It's pretty, pretty intense winters yeah, out here. I think we just have nothing better to do in the winter <laughs> than lock ourselves into a garage and try and get good at music, I guess. I don't it, know. It's funny because that's what people say in Seattle about the rain, but when you really talk about being housebound, I mean. Yeah, the rain is nothing. Seattle, <laughs> come on. Did you rec did you move to British Columbia? Did I read or? I did, yeah. Um, Calgary was starting to get a little bit too big, and my girlfriend got into school in Nanaimo, so it's a nice laid back place to sort of call home. Nice. Home is very relative at this point, but. Well, we like having you closer. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Is the whole band there, or now you're uh, bi coastal? Uh, we're talking about doing a, a mass exodus <laughs> for sure. Well, you're all welcome. Come on over here to the <laughs> West Coast. Viet Cong here live in the KEXP studios. You got time for one more? We absolutely do. To a bottom, you can see that curse. Situation bending in and out of
Oh my God, that was nuts. <laughs> So awesome. Viet Cong live on KEXP. Can you guys still breathe? Uh, barely. Man, leaving it all on the dance floor. Thank you so much. Thanks for having us. That was incredible. Playing tonight at Mississippi Studios in Portland and coming back up to Seattle for a sold out show at Barbos on March 27th. Thank you again. That was great. Viet Cong from their new self titled album. This is KEXP Seattle. Discover new music at listenerpoweredkexp.org.